the easiest label when I dropped the ANCAP phase for me to place myself into is far right. Because, well, when we think of the most edgy kind of right wingers, we think of the guys that are saying so many politically incorrect stuff. Like racialism. Anti-Semitism, all this, all this stuff with the alt right. I think it's a little more safe. You could be an all right guy, and the only thing that's edgy about you is the fact that you're you dislike feminism. That's about it. It doesn't usually go too far. You don't like Obama. Well, okay, I mean, yes, that's a very unfair summary of the alt-right, but the alt-right has its, its things, the far-right, the far-right is less return of kings, it's less of that large sphere, and it's more edgitarian, it's more politically incorrect. 4chan, and while I never really liked 4chan up until maybe this month, actually, I've been on 4chan a lot more, I've been on the retro video games board trying to get some information, get some knowledge, since I gotta stay educated as a Let's Player now, but... <laughs> I really should turn that lamp on, by the way. The reason I'm seeing all of this is that I look at it now and what do I say? What do I believe in that's really right wing? Or left wing? Or anything in that binary? I mean, I'm not for any type of economic structure. I don't care about communism, socialism, capitalism, distributism, mutualism. Run it down. I don't really... I'm totally indifferent to it and I become more and more indifferent to it the more I'm around that environment because it just seems like nothing to me so and moreover, when it comes to my type of government, my ideal type of government, I left anarchism December 6th, 7th, 8th of 2012, and I don't really care about monarchy. I'm not too critical of democracy. I mean, you've seen that I kind of flip-flop with it. Would a republic be okay? I don't know. I don't care. Just leave it at that. Fascism, I don't know. Well, fascism is like kind of like... You could say that in an economic way or a political structure. It's kind of weird like that. But other than that, I really have no clue. I just don't care. There's nothing I believe in that's in a left or right binary. There's a lot of that weird racialist shit I say. There were a lot of those edgy blog posts where I started speaking about Slavery, freedom, how dumb masses are. No, I was going through that phase where I was transitioning in viewpoints, and so I said a bunch of weak and base shit because that's what happens when you can't turn your cartilage ideas into some fully established bone ideas. I was still in an infantile state because I was transitioning in thought. 
Okay. In terms of the typical racial viewpoint, I am a heretic in that sense. I'm a heretic in terms of my thoughts on anything that's social justice or even race related. I'm just politically incorrect. There's no need to put like any like left wing or right wing binary label. In fact, I think that in terms of things like racialism and views on gender, you should remove that from any binary. Now, I was able to follow through with all the sounds that were coming from the storm up until then. Now it just sounds like a bad movie trailer. I got like a flash flood warning in my smartphone because my smartphone does that. Guys, don't ever get an HTC phone, by the way. But yeah, I should probably abandon any label left wing, right wing, because what I say doesn't operate under such a binary. I'm just politically incorrect. Can, can I just say I'm just politically incorrect? I'm sure you guys will understand. Most of you. All of you, really. Because I didn't really say anything that's that interesting in this video. Uh, the title will be attention grabbing. That that's it, and I'm sorry that it's an attention grabbing title. So I'm going to make sure the title doesn't grab your attention. That it's just like a typical stupid look from Mr. Rock Seven title. Why is this bitch screaming? Why is this bitch screaming? Fucking assholes. Anyway.